What's going on, James Bonnet is here. In this video, I'm gonna be talking about how to use rep management to not only increase your revenue per client in your agency, but even if you don't have an agency and you've always wanted to start, start one, this might be the easiest foot in the door service you can provide to help kickstart your agency journey. With that being said, there's no fluff here. I'm gonna get right down to business. So most of the time, to understand the importance of something, you're going to go and Google, you know, how important is rep management. Now that we have uh, chat GDP or GPT, whatever you might call it, I just asked it how important are online re reviews for businesses and can you include statistics for businesses in America? Now, for anybody who doesn't know what rep management is, reputation management is basically getting businesses more reviews online, which does a few things. It helps them rank right in the maps area and i'll show you that in a second the more reviews they have it's just one factor but it's a very big factor to ranking and it uh it definitely helps with ranking not only their google business profile formerly known as google my business profile but this is their google business profile with ranking but it also increases the chances of showing up in the maps now if you ask chat gpt how important it is real quick Online reviews are important for businesses because they have a significant impact on a business's reputation. We're just going to jump down here. According to this survey, 84% of people trust online reviews as much as personal recommendations. And 7 out of 10 consumers will leave a review for a business if they are asked to do so. Now, before I go on with this, a lot of people will ask, well, wh what can I say to a business owner uh, to help them understand the importance of it? And the first thing that I'll tell you is you could just say this <laughs> like this is everything that you need to sell this okay a study by review trackers found that a one-star increase in business's average rating on yelp can lead to a five to a five to nine percent increase in revenue podium 92 percent of consumers read online reviews before making a purchasing decision and a positive review could increase the likelihood of a purchase by as much as 270 percent i can go on and on right basically it is extremely important and businesses are starting to now learn this, uh, how important it is, okay? So if I jump over to Google really quick to show an example, okay? And I don't wanna take longer than 15 minutes to explain all this, uh, as well as showing you all this within 15 minutes. Uh, if I just type in like dentist near me, you know, typically you have your ad, right? Then you have your uh, Google business profile rankings in the maps area, and then you have your organic stuff, right? Organic is is kind of this this thing that everybody went after. Everybody was like SEO, organic, ranking, you know, my website, but the reality is is that you are going to be dealing with and competing against the Yelps, right? All the aggregators, okay? All the um, you know, insurance companies, uh, Zocdoc, uh, we can go on and on, right? So these are aggregators and now you have your ads. So typically what what we always recommend is the, the two core, I would say, easiest ways to get results for clients would be from lead gen, right? Google uh, PPC or Facebook ads, and then helping them get more reviews. Now, of course, there's, there's always SEO that plays a role, but if you're just starting out your agency, or even if you've had an agency for a while and you just want to kind of increase the customer value, adding reputation management and doing it in a way I'm going to show you in this video is such an easy way to do it, such an easy way, okay? So now that everybody understands what the reviews are and how important they are, because if I go to um, Wayne Family Dental, right, with 48 reviews, and then I look at James Cho uh, with nine reviews, typically I'm gonna most likely go to somebody who has more reviews, right? That It's just kind of a natural thing. When you go and buy something on Amazon, you look for the things that have the most reviews and four to five stars, you're good to go. And as you know, the importance is all in the data. You could read the importance right here, right? Just pause this and read it. Uh, you can't get any better evidence, okay? So how do you do this? How does somebody help, how does a, a, a marketer or an agency get another business more reviews? I use, um, it's rebranded, go high level, right? It's our own white labeled version of it. A lot of people are using it. Uh, but this is what we use. And we specifically have a snapshot that is built and ready to literally run, plug and play run for uh, businesses, okay? And so 
um, this is this is my dummy account, okay? And so what I want to do is kind of show you the ease of this. Typically, you know, and I can walk you step by step through through it. But if you don't have a, a go high level account, it might not make sense. Uh, there may be a link in the description to get 14 free days, uh, or you could just find me online and message me on how to get it. But with that being said, um, again, this is not going to be a go high level training, but I do want to show you the power of this. So in order to understand this, you need to, if you click on this reputation link, or if I click on it, right, within the system, you will have the ability to request reviews, look at your listings, look at your reviews, respond to the reviews, everything is connected, okay? And if I go over into settings, and I go into reputation management, I'm sorry, and I go into um, integrations, the first thing you, that you would want to do for business, and this is a service that you can charge anywhere between $397 a month to $997 a month for one client, depending if it's ongoing or if it's a one-time deal. You could charge setup fees. The importance of this service is what brings the value to business owners. And if you connect your Google, uh, if you connect the business owner's Google account directly into this software, you have a lot more ease of kind of controlling it, right? Uh, controlling the reviews, responding to reviews, if that's part of the service that you're gonna do, or they can actually log in and do it themselves, or they could have the office staff do it, whatever it might be. But the best part is, after you connect it, is the automation feature that we have in here, okay? We call this snapshot a true review snapshot. We just came up with that name. And essentially what we're doing is, is we have a campaign that we run for past customers. So the biggest thing in this business is how fast can I get a client results? How fast? So imagine you go to a, 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 a business owner and they're like, oh, I've used, I've used markers before, nothing ever happens, yada, yada, yada. And you're able to say, look, I'll tell you what, I won't charge you anything, right? Let me just show you the results that I can get on a small sample size, right? How many clients do you have? Oh God, over the years, I probably have a, a thousand person client list, right? Let's say it's a, um, a dentist or let's say uh, it's a restaurant, right? I want to get them results as quickly as possible. So you could say, give me a list of 50 of them out of a thousand, just give me 50 and let's see what I can get you and what results I can get you. Because ultimately the bottom line is, is that, you know, you need more reviews, correct? Yes. Great. How many reviews have you gotten? Because right now online, I see you only have nine, but your competitors have 200, 300, 400. You understand the impact of what that looks like when somebody is searching for you, what it looks like if somebody's looking for a dentist near me type of thing, right? And you help them understand the importance of it. And once they understand the importance of it and you're actually willing to do a small sample size for them, they're not going to say no. And the results I'll show you of how easy this is. And so in this, the, the automations feature, okay, is that takes a little bit of setup, but if you have the snapshot, 90% of it's done for you. And we offer a quick win with a giveaway. This would be past customers. And all we do is, and you could take a look here. Um, once we, once we get the, we upload the contacts, this automation takes place, right? And so the first thing, and you can make this as long as you want, but the first thing we do is we send them a text message and then we send them an email. In order to do that, they need to have a customer list of, uh, of the name. You don't even really need to have the name, but na let's call it a name, email, phone. If, you, if they don't have the phone, it's okay because uh, it'll just skip this. So the very least an email. And all it's saying is, hey, this is so-and-so with the company name. We're doing a customer appreciation giveaway. Here is the contest prize, $50 Amazon gift card, let's say. It only takes 10 seconds to leave a review on Google and be entered to win. So this automation will go out once I upload the contacts and give them a tag of reactivation review, okay? Okay, once they get uploaded into here, we are then looking to see everybody who clicks a the what we call a trigger link. You know, all a trigger link is is we take the real link and make a trigger link. So if it's clicked, then we then we can use automation to say, hey, remove them from this automation. We, if somebody leaves a review, they click the link. We don't want to keep asking them to leave a review. Okay, and so once they click this trigger link, they will get a review link click tag, and they're going to be removed from two automations. Okay, now if they don't right? They're not clicking anything. We're going to wait a day. 
we're going to send them another text and an email. If they haven't done anything, we'll wait five days, send them another text. Now, we don't want to bombard their customers. We want to be nice and easy and ask if you know they'd be willing to leave a review for us. And then if there's a negative feedback, okay, and somebody leaves a bad review, all we do is this. We're going to go over to sites. We're going to go over forms. Okay, and so obviously you can see in this software, there's a lot of amazing stuff. All right, and this would be a form. Let me go integrate. And let me just go to the link and show you. And so if you ask this, how would, how would you rate us, right? And you could edit this in any way you want. And they leave a four star. Then we connect their, their Google review link in, the autom uh, in this form. And it'll send them to, um, I think this was the example. Yeah, this was an example. It'll send them right here and they can leave a review. Now, the beauty of it, is if they do this and they do two star, sorry to hear that you're not satisfied, please provide us with your feedback, we'll do our best to improve. And if they fill this out and they chose a bad, they essentially just gonna go right into the negative feedback. And that negative feedback now is saying, we're gonna remove them from everything, add a negative feedback, and now we're gonna let the client know, hey, uh, so and so just provided some negative feedback on their experience. Here's what they gave you out of five stars, three stars. This was the comment they left. Please reach out to them as soon as possible to remedy their experience. Phone number and here's their email. So you have all these safety features that you could do. And that is why we know without a shadow of a doubt that if somebody leaves a bad comment, they can still go to Google, right? We're not stopping them. They can just Google and leave a bad review. But now when we're reaching out, it'll at least deter those who are not going to leave a bad review on Google. We'll stop them with a form, okay? We call it gated, all right? We do the, and so well, you may say, well, how do you get contacts in here? So you simply go into the contacts form, you upload the contacts, you give them a reactivation review and negative feedback tag, and that is, well, that was an example, but you give them a, reactivation review tag and that reactivation review tag puts them in to this automation and then the rest takes care of itself and the reason why i love this service so much is not only will you get great feedback from i mean at least they have a terrible business but you're gonna get great feedback from past customers who are happy you're gonna increase their reviews you're gonna help them rank in the maps uh, listings and you're gonna show and prove your worth to them so they can become a client now, again, what is the information you have to give them to help them understand the importance? Just use chat GPT and you can use the data here, right? You can literally build a sales page right from here with reputation management. But I, we used to use grade.us. Uh, I can't remember the other name. We used to use a lot of different softwares to help uh, our student base uh, do this. But then there was all these different costs that everybody had to pay for. And so we obviously use Go High Level, which is the greatest thing since sliced bread. And that is exactly what reputation is. It's exactly why it's important. And you can use a simple tool like Go High Level. Uh, again, 14 free trial. If you want to use it, uh, just click it down below or reach out to me directly. You could find me on Instagram. You could find me on uh, everywhere, right? I'm, I'm everywhere. Just Google James Bondies. And that is exactly how, because with a snapshot, you will save a lot of time, all right? And if you already have all the accounts, I have no problem. I will share this snapshot with you and be able to um, help you out in that way, if, if, if at all. Just do me a favor and like, subscribe to this channel because I have a ton. I've scheduled videos for the next two months coming out. So uh, it's all gonna be about agencies, growing your business, how to find clients, best websites to find clients for your agency, uh, money, uh, real estate, business, everything you can think of. So. If you like this video, like, subscribe, comment down below, and uh, I look forward to uh, reading your comments and answering back if I need so. Thanks. Appreciate your time. Talk soon.